You probably already know that you can create mock-ups in Canva, different mock-ups for digital products or physical products. You can easily just drag and drop your images in and create beautiful mock-ups. Well, Canva now has video mock-ups. So in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you the new Canva video mock-ups and how you can use them so that you can really bring your mock-ups to life even more. They don't just have to be a still image, but they can be something that's really brought to life. So let's dive in. So let's make some video mock-ups. So the first thing you want to do is create a video page so we can go to create a design and then we want to choose video so any video is fine I might just go choose YouTube video so obviously you'd think about what you're using it for what size is going to be best for you now we're going to head over to apps and you're going to look up mock-ups so you select here this mock-up app and as you can see here, there is a videos section. So we can click on see all to see all the video mockups. And this is where you can choose the mockup that you would like to use. Now you can choose one where you like the background and you want to use the whole thing to create your mockup, or you can always use Canva's video background remover to remove the background and then put other things behind it. So let's say for example, that we like this mug turning around we didn't really want the background on it. We wanted to do other things with it, maybe add other things behind. So what we're going to do is first add in our mock-up. So as you can see here, it shows you to insert the image. You do it just like you would with a photo. So we're going to, you probably have something that you want in uploads, but I'll just go to elements to grab something to show you. So let's say for example, this BU, that was our mock-up picture. So we just drag and drop it on and just wait for it to load. And there we go, it is now placed in and we can watch it. And as you can see, you have this beautiful video mock-up where it actually moves. Now, if you'd like to move the image in your mock-up, so maybe it doesn't position it quite right, you can click on it. And then you're going to see here, it's got um, smart crop, alignment, flip, detach image. So this is where we can look through and we can move it around so we can fit. So this fit one, when you click on that, you can resize it so you might Want it to be more zoomed in or more zoomed out. As you can see, this image isn't really ideal for this. It has to be zoomed in to actually fit. But obviously, you probably have a design that is perfectly fit. And But if you need to make those adjustments, that's where you go to make those adjustments. Now, as you can see, initially, you don't have that option to remove background. And so we want to download it so we can do that. So we can go to download MP4, download it. Now, while that's downloading, I'll show you other mock-ups. So we can see there are all these other ones that have really beautiful backgrounds too. If you want to stick with the background, something like this, and you can just press play to check it. You can see that's got a nice shadowy background on it. So we can upload something into that. So as you can see, if you've got some sort of digital product and you want to create a really nice mock-up, you could make this beautiful video like this, where it's just got this beautiful background in it. And that looks really nice. Now, going back to this one. so. We're going to delete it and we're going to in uploads, upload file. And now we're going to upload the one that we just downloaded before. All right, so now we can put it on the page and now we have the background remover. So we can add a background, whatever we want to do, add text to the side of it. And so as you can see, you can create something really cool. Now, when you get rid of the background, it means that you can change where it is on the page, which can be handy if you need to do something, we need some writing on the side and maybe the original just didn't give space for that. By removing that background, now you've got the space you need to be able to do that. And so you can create a really fun interactive mock-up, really brings it to life. So give it a go, have some fun making your own video mock-ups. And if you'd like to learn more about how to use Canva, about branding, graphic design and creativity, make sure you subscribe to this channel and I'll see you next time.